What's up guys, Joe here at Chemical Guys Detail Garage. Today we got this filthy Toyota Tacoma and as you guys can see, we got chunks of dirt on the paint. This is gonna require a little bit more of a different wash method than just our traditional wash. Uh, we're gonna definitely go ahead and be foaming this vehicle just because this dirt is very thick and is dried onto the paint. Something like this can actually scratch your surface if you're not being careful or if you're not using proper lubrication. So today we're gonna to show you guys how to simply wash this paint without scratching or installing any other swirl marks to this you know, vehicle. The only difference is gonna be, we're gonna be starting with the body of the vehicle first. We're not gonna be starting with the wheels just because you know, usually that's what we tell you to start off with. In this case, since the body's a lot dirtier, we're actually gonna address these at a later time and the undercarriage because we wanna tackle this first and just clean the vehicle so that we don't scratch the paint. We're gonna be following a two foam process, which means that we're gonna do one coat of foam, let it lather, and then we're gonna rinse it off. And then we're gonna do another coat of foam and follow it up with the wash mitt and a two bucket method so we don't scratch up the paint. So one thing I do wanna address is that one, I am gonna foam this vehicle before I rinse it just because the reason for that is that if I were to go ahead and use a high pressure water source with the level of dry dirt that's on this paint, it can actually be very abrasive and it can possibly scratch the surface just with that pressure and that dryness from the dirt. All right guys, so let's get foaming. All right guys, so now that we foamed up the car, if you guys want to come get a little close up on this, we actually foamed it up with our Torx Snubby, our big mouth foam can and some Tough Mudder. As you can see, those are some thick chunks of dirt on there. You'll see that there's also like this dripping over here where it kind of looks like cookies and cream ice cream. Uh, that's a good sign. That's just showing us that all that grime and you know, dirt is being pulled down by this lubrication so that once we go ahead and rinse it right off right now, we're not going to be creating a, an abrasive kind of you know, rinse. So now further ado, we're gonna take out our foam cannon, we're gonna put our pressure washer tip, and then we're gonna to proceed to rinsing out the foam. All right guys, so as you guys saw, that Tough Mudder did a really great job at breaking down that heavy grime, but now we wanna take care of the fine grime that's still stuck in between the trims of the vehicle. So we're gonna go ahead and follow it up with one more coat of foam because we want that lubrication so that when we go with our two bucket wash method, we don't scratch or install any swirl marks to the paint. We're also gonna be adding Walker to the mix. Why? Because I'm short and I can't reach up there, so he's gonna help me get up there and clean that area. So without further ado, let's get foaming. So now we're gonna be wiping down the paint. We're gonna be doing the two bucket wash method, which pretty much means we have one bucket full of soap and water, and then the other one just with water. So when we wanna rinse our mitt, we don't get that grime that we're knocking off the paint back onto the paint and you know scratching the paint up. So without further ado, we're gonna go ahead and dunk our wash mitt into our soap bucket. And Walker, we're gonna go and follow straight linear motions, all right? So that means one way, top to bottom, do another wipe, and since this vehicle is kind of dirty, I do want to do a little more rinsing just so that I don't scratch up the paint and I want to make the best use out of these dirt traps. All right guys, so we're done washing the vehicle. We're done rinsing it off. We're gonna proceed to drying it. If you guys like this truck and you guys wanna see more of this truck, make sure to like this video, comment down below what you wanna see, and let us know any other future videos that you guys wanna see on this channel. This has been Joey, Walker, Chemo Guy, Detail Garage. We'll see you guys next time.